What's going on, YouTube gang? It's Mel DFS coming to you live and direct. Here to give my favorite plays. We got a four game main slate. Hope everybody's having a great day. Feel free to like the video. Please subscribe to the channel. Press that bell icon and always stay notified for new videos. Let's get into these plays. Going to the first play at the point guard spot. We want to pay up. We do have Steph Curry at 96 on DraftKings. He's 10,000 on FanDuel. He's averaging 50 fantasy points in the past five. 30 points, 7 rebounds, 5 assists a game. And Miami's allowed average 36 face points to the position. He did have a 59 face point game last go around against them this season. So something to look at if you want to pay up at his price point, more so on DraftKings. Another play to look at is D Russ. He's 7,000 on DraftKings, 75 on FanDuel. Going against Phoenix, he's averaging 32 fans points in the past five games, 12 points, 6 assists a game. And Phoenix and Lyon average 47 fans points to the position. It's a great game to look at for D Russ in this play for today. So let's go to our next play, going to our shooting guards. Zach Levine, he's 75 on DraftKings, he's 73 on FanDuel. I just like the price tag overall. He's averaging 37.9 fans points in the past five, averaging 22 points a game. As Brooklyn allows an average 26 fans points to the position, he is averaging 42.7 fans points in the past three games last season against Brooklyn. And the last time he played at Brooklyn, he had a 53 fans point game. Zach Levine, and we have the news that Kobe White is out. That's helping usage. Go to our next play, going to our small forwards. Andrew Wiggins, he's 69 on DraftKings, 73 on FanDuel. He's averaging 38 fans points in the past five. And going against Miami, they're allowing 33 fans points to the position. I definitely think he's a safe spot overall. Check him out in the last five games. He's giving you value in his matchup. Go to our next play, going to our power forwards. Paolo Banchero, 79 on DraftKings, but he is priced up on FanDuel at 8,500. He is averaging 38 fantasy points in the past five. Getting around 40 fantasy points, went away. OKC is allowing average 26 fantasy points for the position. Banchero on a great play to also look at. Another spot to also consider is Draymond Green at 57 on both platforms. Averaging 27 face points in the past five. Averaging 10 points, six rebounds a game, and Miami is allowing average 30 face points to the position. I like to spot for Draymond Green under 6K on both platforms for today. Let's go to our last play, going to our center position. Center play got Bam Adebayo at 74 on DraftKings. He is averaging 18.7 rebounds a game, 35 phase points in the past five, and Golden State allows average 31 phase points to the position. He did have a 49 phase point game last game this season against them, so do like Bam and a great play on both platforms. Another play I also look at is Wendell Carter Jr., especially on FanDuel at 6,400. Going against OKC, he's averaging 32 phase points in the past five, 14 points, 10 rebounds, as OKC allows an average 10 rebounds a game, 35 phase points to the position. So like this spot for Wendell Carter Jr. These are my favorite plays. Like the plays, get a thumbs up. Any questions, comment below. Using Draft Dashboard tools and the link in my description. Want to sign up? It is a dollar up to 30 days. Once you sign up, get access to the NBA cheat sheet, sleepers and your studs. Click on the watch players. You get my plays up top for watch Mel's DFS picks for either DraftKings or FanDuel. So I love y'all. Y'all collect that bag. It's Mel DFS and y'all stay blessed. And I see y'all in the next video.